Actual. Hello, Pirates of Class 2026. R is for respectful. Hey, Class 2024. A is for aspiration. You get it. It's about time. Coach Williams here. We're at the DeKalb County Cross Country Championships today. Uh, just ready to compete, represent the school well, showing what we've been working on these last month and a half. And, um, you know, just keep working hard. Go Pirates. Good job. Got PR. <laughs> yes, congratulations. All right, Michael. All right, Corey, come here you on. Go. Keep on moving up! People are looking at Reese's because like, yeah. I keep telling people, like, I'm not that good of an actor. Like, I'm just putting work. I'm not athletic. Like, <laughs> but it's just like, there's more people. All right, man. Just, you got to work. Run strong, run strong. Yeah. 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 Watch your back, watch your back. Or business education. I have been authorized to conduct the installation of Stone Mountain High School into the national chapter of FBLA PBL Incorporated. FBLA PBL is designed to promote future business leaders. It is fitting as we begin this new year that we consider what these words represent to our organization. Future. Our daily educational experiences and our involvement in leadership activities prepare us for the future at a time to accept challenges. In FBLA, we find the tools to prepare for the future. We will profit from the experience of others, those who have preceded us, as well as our teachers and others with whom we associate. Our students and activities will help us meet changing conditions and further our understanding of the world's varied economic system. My schedule to let you know how much I appreciate the work that you do and how much I support your efforts. So if you are ever in need of anything and I can, I can help you in any way, please let me know. So proud of our new officers, our returning members, and again, let me know if there's anything I can do. Keep up the good work. As you know, we're all interacting with digital devices, day and night. Digital media offers an empowering set of tools. Everyone can access, move, reshape, and reshare creative content in all kinds of new ways. As we use our devices, we are consumers of creative work. Music, movies, books, images, games, software, and more. We're also creators as we take photos, write and record songs, make movies, write stories, develop apps, games, and more. Since we all interact with, create, and share each other's work, knowing the rules of the road for getting and using creative work legally and ethically is one of the essential literacies of our time. Those rules are governed by copyright. 
In the past, copyright was something that only big publishing houses or movie studios needed to think about. But today, copyright is more relevant to our day-to-day -day activities than ever before. As we navigate the many choices we have as both creators and enjoyers of media, there are some important legal and ethical considerations we need to keep in mind. Like, just because something is easy from a technology standpoint, like digital file sharing, that doesn't mean it's automatically okay. Our internet communities work best when we understand the basic ground rules and treat each other fairly. Respecting the rights of artists and creators benefits all of us, as we, in turn, are artists and creators.